Hello and welcome to Escape the North, the only North of England simulator, escape simulator, role playing game, trauma simulator. We don't know what it is. We created it and it's, it's out of our control now. Welcome, friends, viewers, players. I hope you are ready for a good time. I hope you're ready to escape Sheffield. I'm uh, Jack Evans, the mayor's assistant. Uh, we're currently waiting to find out who the mayor is. Keeps changing who the mayor is. It's all over the place, you know? But, you know, as they say, you can't have too much democracy. Um, something has happened in the chat which is initiating a series of animations which I find deeply distracting, but don't understand. Um, if anyone could explain what's happened, we're apparently at level three. That feels better. Uh, we're going up. We're at ah, a hype train. I see. I have seen my comrades, my fellow maze assistants, Sean Morley and Jane Otis, be distracted by this exact same phenomenon. Um, choo choo. Um, hello, everybody. Hello, Disconnected Dan. Hello, Josie Russell. Hello, Harry Hardy. Hello, Stegligs. Hello, Rugug38. Hello, Raspy Panda. It's how pandas, they all, almost all are. They've got a very strange diet. Um, hello, Shara. H hello, Sarah, the Sarah K. Uh, hello, Pete and all these. Um, Saint Lob. Hello, greetings. Um, I'm, I'm pumped. It's, it's going to be an absolute bang, isn't it? I feel like the issue we're having with the mushrooms, which as you can see is kind of exacerbating, the, you know, we've got a problem down there. Uh, we've got a little bit of a problem over there with the mushrooms. Um, I'm, you know, it's kind of winding me up. I might have to crack open a bit of Hendo's just to, uh, just to nourish myself a little. Um, you know, people say, well, actually drinking something that salty is not actually going to hydrate you. But I find that I like it and then it and then it makes me more thirsty and then I enjoy the the next drink, you know. Right, right. <laughs> I can't the other you, you have to the key this very Why isn't it help? Oh oh very hard to drink that. <laughs> um I don't know if maybe more than one of us was uh making Whoa whoa, who's this? Who's trying to Who's that out there? Hello? Wait, uh, uh, uh... There's some people, got three people down here. Got three people? Could they three be mayors, people. do you reckon? Are three, they up for mayoring? For, yeah, 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 they said, they said they're ready to, um, to be brought over. Is that, is that all right to bring let's, them up? Let's bring them in, let's bring them in and get their mayor. Okay, I'll, I'll ask them to start climbing the stairs. Yeah, yeah, get them up here. It's quite, it's quite high up in the, uh... Mayor's office, you've got to keep it high because most of the attempts on Mayor's lives come from high up. Um, or people who've got very, very poor cardio ability. Um, questions about Lloyd, did Lloyd just lick the microphone? Um, Lloyd's actually a master um, of tech and he can actually tell if a kind of any kind of electronic system is working correctly by taste. Um, not a lot of people know that, um, but Lloyd can actually do that. So you, if you, you're trying to kind of throw around accusations as if this is some sort of strange behaviour, Lloyd knows what he's doing, okay? Lloyd knows what he's doing. I will hear no bad mouthing of pop-up Lloyd. Uh, questions, what does the mayoral reception desk taste like if licked? Spilt Hendos. Spilt Hendos. Spilt Enjoy, Enjoy that, that screenshot. That screenshot. Doesn't I think the people uh, the Ooh. people are here were ready to, to go over Let's now on, then. to the uh, mayor induction office. Fantastic. Let's get cracking. Jack, Let's would you crackin'. like would you like to jump into the UI please? I would like to jump into the UI. Can I be placed into the UI? Yeah, if you just jump in, I'll make sure you land okay, in the right go. place. I'm ready. Okay, tell me uh, when. Count me down. Count me down. You do this bit. Okay. Ready? Huh. Jump huh. Lord. Tell you what, it's looking pretty bland in here. 
the... A lot of this white walls, nothing here, nothing to... Yeah. Nothing rubbish. We've already had a donation, as you can see, Sean, there, that did it. We're getting towards the ribbon cutting ceremony target, um, and in order to unlock that, which is the, oh. the big treat, but each donation, if you donate above five pounds, you can add decor to the mayor's assistant's wow. office for the for scrutiny wow. by the various mayor's assistants. Wow. It'll make Sean Molly very wow. happy. Look how happy is just wow. the idea of it. Think how happy he'll be when those decor <laughs> are rolling. He expands and contracts with joy. Wow. He's a happy little fella. <laughs> Just gonna go back in the crawl space. I can't wait to see what it's gonna look like later. It's all right. Um, if anyone else, you know, is curious about what's going on before we move on behind the uh, door, we'll have a little look. Jellyfish. The jellyfish. Let's get Mayor in. Here we go. Please bring in the uh, the elements of mayor. Player, mayor number one. Mayor one, hello, how's it going? Hello, not too bad, thank you. Fantastic to hear. Would you like to be known as something other than mayor number one? I would, um, mm -hmm. but I'd like to delegate that decision to the chat, please. Okay, chat. Risky, brave. Uh, Mayor One, what is their designation chat? I think it's going to be Josie exclamation mark. That sounds good. I can go with that. Mm -hmm. Can we have, yep, okay, it's being input. You have J. Not sure you're getting anything else. It's a good start. I think there's some discussion occurring as to the the spelling. I think I think it I think we have to spell it J zero five one three. Nice. No, I'll have the two back, please. I don't think. Yes, yeah, there we go. It's, there we go. Yeah. How do I pronounce that, please? Uh, Josie. Okay. <laughs> Mayor 2, would you like to enter? Hello, Mayor 2. Hello. Sorry, it was a long way up those stairs. Listen, we've we've all got, you know, not everyone's cardio's on it. We've got to make sure you reach a certain level before you can come into the mayor's office. So, in case you need to flee. Um, mayor 2, how would you like to be known? Uh, could I be known as Mighty Fighty Shushbugs? We can try. It might have to involve um, changing the font size. Mighty fighty shush bugs. Yeah. Okay. I think the font is being sarcastically made larger. That's better. Um, so, yeah. <laughs> might fail. Um, it's all in there. Shush. It's all in there. We know it's there. I'll take um, your word. Yeah. Yeah, I wouldn't lie. Um... I've never lied. <laughs> uh, should we bring in your your third element, Mayors One and Two? Let's let's yeah. uh, Mayor let's Three, see. welcome. Mayor Enter. Third entering. Hello. Hello. Looking extremely debonair, Mayor Three. Uh, how would you like to be known, friend? Oh, I think I'd like to be Geronimo. <laughs> Geronimo. <laughs> I'm going to be in the impulsiveness center of the brain. Uh, there is a um, very uh, ethnically insensitive... Um, Josie's gone. She's had enough. Oh, no, but she's back. She had enough and then thought, actually, no, I'm into it. Um, Geronimo, uh, a place called Geronimo is in Rill, um, which uh, had one of them vertical slides where you weren't allowed tracky bottoms on because if you went down them in tracky bottoms, they would ignite on fire. <laughs> and... Uh, I had some absolute top times in that. Um, actually, top times in there, inebriated as an underage person. <laughs> ah, it was a, 
it's quite it's worrying. Perhaps it's, you know, if you think is this about how it so the, the ski slope came to be in its current form. <laughs> Um, I think fine. if the youths of Rill have got to Sheffield, um, that whatever has happened to the ski slope might have something to do with them. They tend not to uh, improve an area uh, with their uh, with their various powers. Um, so, hmm. Geronimo, are you happy with this spelling? Yes. Um, I gave it my best shot. I can't. Really I think you smashed it. I think you smashed it. I, I think. There. I think real ethical questions. We've got those ethical questions about the use of the name Geronimo. There's ethical questions about <laughs> continuing, as we have for months now, f- forcing a man with dyslexia to type things in a public, uh, <laughs> for, really for other people's entertainment. Um, so. Rill has a deafening aura, says Raspy Panda. <laughs> Correct. Um, and it, it, the reason for that is, is it's like, um, you know, like eldritch gods. If you if you see the things you can't comprehend it and then like you kind of mind, it has to deafen you because if you heard some of the stuff that was being said in Rill, the truths that were being dropped, you'd just, your brain, you know, it's, it's to protect you, okay? It's mainly, it's to protect the English. Um, okay. Mayors. You are. You have your nomenclature. Shall we have your characteristics, friends? Yes. Let's do it. Would any of you? We've got to choose a flagship policy. Would Would you like to do this cooperatively, or would one of you like to be an authority figure, perhaps a captain of some kind? Let's uh, let's let's take the take the task on together to begin with. See, that yeah, instant decision gives you big Captain Energy Josie. <laughs> De facto Captain Josie, who has gone into the power vacuum. Um, okay, flagship policy. What is it? Option one is fly tipping crackdown, i.e. fly living wage. Flies shouldn't have to rely on tips in order to supplement <laughs> <laughs> okay. They should everyone's angry about this, you know. A lot of people saying we have to rein in fly tipping. They look they look behind the house, they see fly tipping, they're outraged. It needs to be stopped. Option two. Ultra tram! Oh no. I'm very you're, taken already. You're very taken. <laughs> you've already got so there's a there's a lot of, there's a lot going on here. There's a super tram already in super Sheffield. I'm not sure what makes a super. No one knows. I feel like an ultra tram. What do you think an ultra tram might feature? <laughs> Better logo. I, I mean, yeah, straight away. <laughs> yeah, that'd do it. Do it. I think people would be happy with that. Bigger goes off both sets of rails at once. Yeah. <laughs> goes, <laughs> goes both ways at once. Yeah. Uh, third option, please. Legalize a petty crime. It's petty because it's small. So why should it be illegal? It's a convincing argument. Big vote winner. Next policy, please. Childhood Tamagotchi location revealed. <laughs> a lot of people had them. Where did they go? You know. You have the technology to know. They have four choices, folks. Begin deliberation. I I would like to know where all the Tamagotchis are, but honestly, I don't think there's there's not really a question in this, is there? Would that not? Would the Tamagotchi thing just be like a single landfill location? Though is that does that is that one of those policies that sounds good and then is mm. relatively disappointing? That's the what? concern, isn't it? Why would they be in a landfill? Are you suggesting <laughs> they didn't go missing? That your parents actively threw them into the rubbish to stop uh, you playing with them because they were irritated with them? They've gone to a very nice farm landfill. <laughs> <laughs> Farm landfill is what the entire of the UK will be by 2042. But it's fine because we'll be able to get around it by ultra tram. Yeah. Oh yeah, we'll be zooming <laughs> round both rails of the tram in full use, okay. round and round, and it never stops. You have to just jump on or off at your place, and then you go, you do your shift on the landfill farm. Like farming. a lateral pattern roster, you say? <laughs> <laughs> exactly like a. La- Please change Ultratram to lateral pattern roster. <laughs> it's true policy. I think I've got a feeling that's where we go. We go in Ultratram. It's, it's got to be the Ultratram. Yeah, 100%. Ultratram. Ultra Locked in. Next question, please. 
choose your closet skeleton. This is your terrible secret that, if found out, could ruin your career as mayor. Killed Brum <laughs> in a drag race. It's a pretty. That's pretty dark. Next option. Did a data breach. Naughty. Illiterate. Knows Yorkshire tea grown elsewhere. <laughs> it's not grown in Yorkshire. Now, I feel like illiterate isn't isn't that much of a skeleton. I, it's, I, I, it's just a thing, really, isn't it? Don't um, need to read things when you do the first thing that comes to mind immediately. <laughs> true, true. Um, and I do feel like the uh, the the tea situation could blow the entire sort of mayoral system wide open. Mm -hmm. um, but that's just knowledge yeah. we have, right? Like mm -hmm. the other things are like negative. Well, potentially negative about us, whereas the knowledge of we didn't grow the Yorkshire tea outside of Yorkshire the Yorkshire tea grew us listen it's an accepted we're in Yorkshire right and if you even hint <laughs> that it's n Yorkshire tea isn't a Yorkshire thing mm. you can get in real trouble I don't I feel like you're playing with fire here as the mayor's assistant I just want to keep okay. you aware it's, of the danger, the danger of even that knowledge <laughs> it's very powerful but I think Conversely, that might give us the the kind of the energy we need to succeed. In... We could play with I fire. Agree. Ooh. Fire I could think, be what killed. I think that should be our skeleton. I think. I, I think it's it's Yorkshire tea. What, um, I think we just had a giant mega donation from Maggie FBK. Uh, Seventy-five pounds. Thank you very much, Sarah K. Ten pounds. Thank you very much. Uh, thank you. She's thank a good you. one, that Matt. Um, so we go in. We go in Yorkshire Tea, folks. Is I think so. Nice. Okay. Next option. Choose a talent. Nose if bin day. Wherever you are, whenever you are, you can feel which bins men to be out and when. Pretty powerful. Pretty powerful. Can eat and digest gun. <laughs> Next option. Little burger in pocket. <laughs> Just a little one. Little, little one. Primo bundas. Primo bundas. <laughs> means your buttocks are absolutely fantastic. Ah. Right. Thank you. Yeah. In what um, language? language. <laughs> slang. The language of slang. Youth slang. Now, based on my experience of Escape the North... Okay. I, I, I like that I, you I, think I, that's I, some sort of metric go, for what go, will happen go, in go. the future. Well, yeah, I, I, I realise it's not necessarily to be relied upon. But the, mm. the idea of being able to eat and digest a gun does seem like it, it, it would have helped several times in the past. Ooh. Um, <laughs> however, um, We're not I, in the I past. have just seen one, one of the other JCs uh, has just said bin tuition Ooh. in the chat and oh, and I think that's very good. That's very bin good. tuition. It's calling me. We're going for nose if bin day. Uh, other mayors, are we voting for that? I mean, yeah, I, I, Josie's I, captain. I, I don't know if we should pass up the primo bundas that fast, but if if bin tuition clings it, then I'll I'll go along. Bin tuition, it is. Let's move to the mayor's office and uh, see what's kicking off, get some work done. Okay, so uh, what you want to do is uh, beckon Wave the him gavel in. around threateningly. Oh, you, can, yeah. you, can, you can move the butter gavel around. The gavel is primarily used yeah. to... Yeah! Uh, you feel powerful, mayor? You feel yeah. good? 
Yeah. <laughs> this is you got big mayor vibes already. I can feel the power. <laughs> it's, it's electric. Um, so you wanna you wanna usher in your first uh, petitioner, I think, uh, and see what they want, and let's see if we can help them out. I'll, I'll hand over to you to usher them in, beckon them in. Come forth and know me, better man. <laughs> Hello. All right. How do you do? Oh. <laughs> 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 um, um, are you into your snooker? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, the clacking of the balls, the waving of a stick. Perfection. Well, we, as you may know, Mayor, we are having a snooker game down at the Crucible. And we've been having some problems getting players in. What with all the hooligans putting people off. But moreover, they've been forgetting... They've been forgetting that they need to be bringing their own extra heavy duty snooker cues and green balls. You know, anything will go for a ball. Green, bulbous, round ball object. So could you be could you be sorting that out for us? Just sort of tell them whatever so, they want to hear is my yeah. general tip. Yeah, I, we'll, we'll, we'll certainly look into it for you. Oh yeah, this sounds like a great this sounds like a great opportunity for an information campaign. Oh, it's <gasps> happening again. <laughs> I think we've got to gavel. We're we going to gavel? Gavel. Gavel. Yeah, gavel. yeah please, gavel. quickly. Gavel. quickly. Oh. Ah. Yeah! Score one for the mayor. Mayor, can I just say, you are smashing it. A possibly demonically possessed being came in. You were not phased at all. And you just immediately offered to sort out whatever they were rambling about. This, this is raw hot politics. Straight off the barbecue. Let's get another one in. I want to see how you deal with another. Double on the head. Perfect. Beckon. Next, please. Hi. Hi. Hello. Hello, Maya. Hi, it's me, the sunflower. Hello, the sunflower. How are you? Oh, I'm very well, thank you. Um, I am, of course, the boss's son. Um, I come with you to you with something quite personal. Um, the last mayor. Uh, really upset my father who is a big tree and lives in the steel plant <laughs> some sicko went in last two weeks ago and said that they liked tea <laughs> my father has never gotten over this would you as the new mayor Go and speak to him? Absolutely. We need to condemn and repudiate the previous mayor for his incompetence and his ill ethics. Yes! <laughs> yes, Jerome! Thank you! Geronimo! Thank you. Jerome? <laughs> I'll see you in the factory! Yeah. Goodbye! This is mayoring. This is hot, singeing mayoring. Is there anybody else out there? Good question. Try beckoning and see what happens. Come we'll forth! We'll give it a go. Oh, this guy. Ah. Hello. Hello there. I am one of the representatives of the mushroom people who have recently surfaced here. And I am here to present you with our story. 
Our plight begins long ago. On the layers of muck and rock below our planet's surface, we ancient mushroom people lived long, simple lives with very reasonable wants and needs. I want a drink. Does anyone seem to throw? I want to put a saddle on a little plastic donkey. I need to put a saddle on a plastic donkey and drink out of it. I want Don't someone to put a saddle on me. <laughs> Sorry. Don't don't apologize for that. The elders kept secret that one day a great chasm in the above land would open up and acted very surprised when inevitably one day it did. Oh, I'm being told I'm quiet. I'm quiet. Oh, here we go. The chasm squeezed itself shut. And pushed us fungal denizens of the deep out. Oh. 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 oh, lovely. Oh, that feels bad. Why am I oh, smaller than right. you two? Why am I still small? Why am I still squeezed? Ow! Fuck off. Ah. Fuck off. Ah. Well, you, Fuck I'm off. thin, but you've gone translucent. We landed in modern day Sheffield. However, below ground, we would live long lives, but above ground, our shelf life is greatly reduced. Oh. Oh. Oh yeah, you're oh. shrinking now, aren't you? Shrink it. Hey, I'm mold. There's I'm no, mold. there's no buckaroo. Yeah. There's no buckaroo up here. Where's the saddle? Is it down there? Yeah, get a ride on oh, this. Oh, oh, God, In order to get here. back to the cool, damp interior of this planet, we need your help to source the components of our big drill. Oh, we need a drill bit. An axle. Oh, well, uh, uh, an engine. Uh, a seat. And some oh, fuel. Alas. Folks, get gavel this mushroom. Get rid. What do you gavel say to our play? Well, sort it out. We'll get round to it. But first, actually, we've got to go to a ribbon cutting. Key mail. You know, you, you're trying to save the world, and then demand for a ribbon cutting comes out. So, do you feel like you're up for a ribbon cutting, Mayor? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Let's let's go. Let's see what needs opening. Edge implements. Hi guys, are you the new mayor? Hello! I'm, I'm head of openings, I'm just here to advise you on um, the sort of things that we could do. So you've been asked here to open this pound bakery incorporating a, a, a pound cafe. Um, as you can see there, I don't know, someone's jumping the gun, going in there for a pastry straight away. So we've got a number of options available to you as mayor. Um, so what color ribbon do you think we would you would like? I can show you what we've brought available today. Hey, we hey, excuse have... me, excuse me. Um yeah? I know I know you're another mayor's assistant that has the specific role of ribbon cutting, but I I've, I've forgotten your name. I know we had that whole HR thing. I'm sorry, I just can't remember your name. Um, can can chat that's, and, and that's also chat is. really wants to know your name, so I'd just really love to know what you're called. Well, it, it is actually quite difficult. I don't I don't blame you for not remembering my name because it is quite difficult to remember. My name is um, Platinum Bathrooms. <laughs> Plats! Good to see. Now I remember. Good to Platinum see you, Platinum bathrooms. B. 
Platinum V. Wow. At least that's not the name of like an Apache chief that we've uh, appropriated. Not to my knowledge. Not to my Well, at the time that they had, they wouldn't, they wouldn't have known about Platinum at the time. So it would exactly. be. Um, anyway, can I. Oh, yeah, get on. on. Sorry this, to interrupt. This, we do yeah. actually have to open this up. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> you know, don't mind me. Don't mind me. Pound, pounds don't last forever. <laughs> Or, or I, don't I, I don't know. I don't. I don't really know about the businesses. I just do. I just help. Me. So, so mayors. We've got uh, a couple of options, uh, ribbon wise. We've we've brought a red, a green, or a blue ribbon uh, for you to choose from. Do you have any? Do you have any preferences of what you think is going to be? Okay, you showed me the red blue ribbon first, so I like red. I think we should keep that red flag flying. Do you want to go red? Okay, that's cool. Like this. Yeah. Finally, um, we have utensils on our first. To, there we go. So we can either go with classic scissor, um, and I, I brought with us hair or carpet. What do you think this sort of environment requires? What do we think, folks? What are we thinking? Let's see, you know, do you show you mash show one you every time. What do you want to go with? Well, Captain. Are you, I, I, are you saying that the classic, classic scissor is uh, is the one you favour? Are the third of a mare? Absolutely, it's the first one that's been presented to me. <laughs> <laughs> Very impulsive. Very impulsive. Um, yeah, let's do it. Um, okay, and they have asked if you could make a quick speech. Go on, mayor. Friends, Sheffield people, mushrooms, this is a bakery. And not just any bakery, this is a pound bakery. And it gives us great pleasure to declare, I haven't even declared it yet. And it's oh, sorry, already- sorry. Um, the, it's... The, <laughs> the, 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 um, So excited to get going. Thank you so much. Great work, Mayor. We're getting some feedback from the from the crowd. They, uh, I'm Pound Bakery. They love the use of the red ribbon. They said that went great with the bakery logo, and um, the standard scissors were a classic. That was a great touch. Well done. The only negative we're getting is the people did feel the music was inappropriate. <laughs> I was thinking that. I was thinking that. It's not. It's not bakery music. So. Why did, you do that, Why did you do that, put that? But after on? this, um, anyway, <sighs> gotta pre gotta press on. Hopefully, hopefully um, next time the music feels more appropriate. We've got to hop we'll, over we'll, to we'll, uh, Mr. Carpet's world now. Again, these people here seem to. What? I'm, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. <laughs> You're stuck. Oh, sorry. Sorry. Oh, sorry. A, a constituent there you go. stuck. Um, there we go. Thank you. <laughs> All right. No, no problem. I, I don't know that person. Um, so we've got two ribbons left. Um, what do you want to go with this time? You've got green or blue? Now, unfortunately, neither of these especially goes with the colour scheme. Um, mm, you, sort but, of, you sort of blew it with the, using the red one early. We did, we did, but uh, I feel like the green complements complements the red. I'm with you there, uh, first one listed. <laughs> okay, let's, green. let's go with green and scissor wise, any preferences? The standard ones are looking a bit blunt, which means we're going to have to go. Hi. Use Hi, sorry. Terrible. Platinum, Platinum. I know you. I know you take the bookings for these ribbon cuttings. You don't happen to know Mr. Carpet's first name, do you? Mister. Oh. Yeah, it's written. Enough, yeah. I'm right sorry. Now, it's it's yeah. written here. Fair enough. Yeah. yeah. Thanks, Platts. No problem. More of um, a, more of an honorific, I'd say. Don't um, question just Platinum. Just before Platinum. we commit to to an implement for this net ceremony. Um, you've, you've not got any any more appointments for us today. That? Um, I don't know. You don't. I, I just know. I just live in the moment, really. Who can so, yeah! 
<laughs> Sorry, what? Who controls that diary? This is two. two I, I do. One day. I, whoa, 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 whoa. Do you want <laughs> me to assist you, or do you, or not? <laughs> yeah, by doing less, uh, less openings. Well, we've got. Look, we need you, the you want to walk away? We want to walk. He's gonna walk away. He's got to walk away from That's going to tank your ratings. That's going to tank your ratings. Yeah, we've got to I need no, carpet. 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 I'm walking carpet. around on the floor. Oh. Yeah, see? What's, this is what inaction does. Look, right, look. A lot of people want access foot. to carpet. That what do you want to do? has to be legitimized by the mayoral scythe. Yes. Carpet, scissors, or hair scissors? Carpet. Uh, carpet. Carpet scissors for a carpet, carpet shop. Carpet scissors. That's... All right, and I believe That's they've asked Biden. if you could do a quick speech. I'll, I'll also, I'll, I'll, I won't jump the gun this time. I'll wait for like a wink. <laughs> wink when you're done. <laughs> Does someone else want to take this one? I you... feel like I've already backpedaled, uh, dug too much of a hole here. Go on, Geronimo. <laughs> Beautiful citizens of Sheffield, we come forth to this wonderful opening where we behold the finest in floor covering specialists. With this great and wonderful ribbon, we will show that we are the city of the here and now, and the eternal future. Slice away and let us flow in like a river. <laughs> Gotta say, great, great feedback on the speech. Um, uh, they, they did sort of ask if we could have gone with the red ribbon though for the branding so we're getting negative feedback from that but they but that's sort of been balanced out by the use of the carpet scissors that was they weren't expecting that they weren't expecting that so final thing left on the diary and then i'll let you i'll let you get on with the rest of whatever it is that um platinum Jack's do you know the citizen no i don't know any of these people can we get They're... rid of that can we get that citizen away from the mayor please look do you want carpet do you want a carpet or not I want to be the mayor's friend. You oh, can't be the mayor's friend. Okay, this, we often have this problem there. I'm, <laughs> Come I'm, here. We can, we can be friends with the citizens. No friends, yeah. no carpet. They said they would be your friends. They said they would be your friends. So where are my friends? Can I have a free carpet? Can I have a free carpet? Can I have a free carpet? No, no, Can I'm I sorry. The mayor, carpet, the mayor doesn't please. own the... The mayor, sir, the mayor doesn't own Mr. Carpet. Mr. Carpet. Mr. Mr. Carpet owns the carpet thing is there free carpets going no 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 well, yeah. come on we gotta get out here man hey, no this is mine this we is mine we we'll go we'll go ah, forget one. about it we'll Platinum, get us out of here final oh. thing to open final thing to open is the river chef from which sheffield almost certainly takes its name um now sadly i think we are we're only left with one ribbon, but it's the blue ribbon, and I feel that's going to be appropriate. Yeah. And I guess you're going to go with the hair scissors seem to be the one that aren't blunt. We've got so, to stop buying single-use scissors. <laughs> well, very wasteful. We've got to buy more single-use scissors. We don't have enough uses of scissors. Uh, that is also a solution. <laughs> I'm confused now. Do you want me to go out and get some more, or is it, are we going to go ahead with these ones? We'll go ahead with this for now, but we'll consider okay. scissor options for the future. And did anyone bring any more music? Because they did say at the last place that it didn't really instill the notion of carpet buying. It's. It, I, I felt it, it worked better for the carpets than it did for the bakery. But uh, um, Ultimately, it's I, my fault. We just have this one ghetto blaster that I carry around. I'm yeah. It's uh, it's it's not great for a river. I mean, we could we could sing. I'm not sure how that would that would affect our ratings. Probably yeah, not. Yeah, try. Well. Let's try that. Well, you could incorporate it into the speech that the owner operators mm -hmm. of the river. No, I think singer of... so, song song instead of a speech. Yeah. Okay. In which case, people of Sheffield, mushrooms et al. Mm -hmm. We now declare this river open. Which means, in the very near future, we will all be rolling on the river. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> uh, Smashed it. Love it. Mayor? Oh. You shouldn't even be mayor and you should be singing. You should be singing. Have we cut the ribbon? Oh, yeah. Well, that, that's probably, yeah. Go on then. Yeah, cut the ribbon. You cut the ribbon, yeah. 
What? Rude. We got feedback of of delayed ribbon cutting causing distress amongst the viewers. I think <laughs> that's very clear. The water yeah. was building up behind the ribbon as well. I think. Mm. Yeah. Um, anyway, thank you, Mayor. I'll I'll be in touch, uh, Jack, um, about um, any future bookings we have got for openings. Thank you. So that's great to say. Um, should I just drop you off outside the mayor's office? Yeah, we're going to get to the saving the mushroom civilization if that's possible. They've been having real problems for weeks now, so. Do they need anything opening? Uh, eventually, I'll, I'll you know I'll put it. I'll, you know we're in the same Google Calendar, so you'll see it pop up. See you later. Cheers, Blatz. Doodle. See ya. See you guys. Hate that guy. Absolute scum. <laughs> I won't tell you why we were in HR, but it's over now. It's been sorted. Um, oh, no, he's cancelled. No, it's not that bad. It's just uh, it's got absolutely no, you know, when someone's name is on a box of biscuits, that's not everyone's biscuits, you know what I mean? So the box is the portion with biscuits, right? Am I right? Pretty much, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. So uh, we're outside. Can you hear... Can you hear a buzzing, Mayor? Sounds like a bee. Oh, yeah, some sort. Ah, of... <gasps> oh, mate. Oh, hello. Goodbye. Wow, how do you want to interact with this bee? It's quite a menacing. Hey, I, I, it looks like it's it's already gone. I said, oh, hello. Hello. It's back. Sheffield um, bees are actually very, very potent, so we should be really careful here, Mayor. So only, only small pieces of bee at a time. Do you want to try to talk to the bee, or interact with the bee I, in I've any been way? I've been trying, but it's not. It, it doesn't seem to be uh, to be responding. Oh hello. oh, hello. How do you do? Well, they've given you a static wound oh. that's disconnected from your body, but near your body, but always hovers near there. They've given you a slightly moving wound. I'll just sit very still. Don't agitate the wound. No. Okay, other aspects of the mayor. <laughs> I feel like we could deal with this. How would you normally deal with a bee, yeah. mayor? Well, we don't have a glass jar of cards, so I think we're going to have to stay still to get bored. Geronimo, these are not the words of the Apache leader. Absolutely! Who did numerous attacks in Mexico. Uh, <laughs> don't we know when, don't we have bin tuition? We know when all the best bins are for the bee. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is a good idea. This is a good idea. Distract Which the bee by telling it about a really good bin. What do we need? Food bin? Food, big, uh, big food bin. We saw it over in the east. <laughs> oh. What's going oh. on? You've deployed a, a bin. You've, you've spawned a bin. And a B. I'm There's not... a bin over there. Go on, B. Worked. He's chasing the bin. Brilliant. Oh, didn't like that sound. Fantastic. We knew bin tuition would come in helpful. Good work, Mike Fig. I see how what you. the public wow. think. Did you just see the oh mayor God. just didn't even swat a bee, just let the bee just sting it twice on the head? Honestly. Cool, calm, collected. That's yeah. what I want in a mayor. Knew that just is. what to do in a crisis. That was incredible. If they can handle a bee like that, imagine them dealing with an interpersonal conflict between humans. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. Well, I'm off down to Wilco. Yeah, I'll come with you, mate. Just, uh, heard they just opened a new pound bakery down there. I'm going to get a saucy Very roll. Nice. In Wilco? Nice. Down that area, down, oh, in, down, no, by no. down by Castle Market in the area. <laughs> okay, okay, Mayor. I, you're okay. smashing it. Yeah. This is quality mayoring. Um, do you want to go in that sort of... Um, yeah, through pool. the portal! I, whoa, whoa, whoa. Shh, shh. <laughs> through the portal, yes, but I think through we should be quiet, quiet when we go in. We don't know what's... Then, 
We immediately Gen- exited the mayor's office to danger, so I feel like we should be a little more careful. I appreciate your enthusiasm. There was, there was a bee, and there's this weird mushroom portal outside. Okay, let's, let's, so, let's, yeah. let's go it, in, but just... We can sprint okay, while sneaking, go. right? Oh, yeah, yeah, definitely. It's cool. just dangerous. Mayor, what? What's going on? They're all asleep. Shall, uh, shall we leave them to slumber? We could, but I also feel like we do need information from them. There may be some proper question nearby. We could, we could make them wake them up. They might be friendly. Okay, so... Buckaroo! Okay, so we try from very quiet to as loud as we get with... Oi, oi. Okay. Oi, oi. Okay. Oi, oi. Do you, should we all do it together? Oh. Oi, oi. Oi, oi. Oi, oi. Oi, oi. Oi, oi. What in tarnation's happening uh, out here? What? What the heck is all this oi oi nonsense when I'm trying to be rolled up in my knapsack? Oh yeah, good morning. Nice day we're having. Uh, so, we need to It was to a go... nice day. I was having a wonderful bit of shit eye until you guys came. What on earth do you want? Uh, we need to know where we can find all these pieces of drill machinery. Oh my god, are you may still on that? Okay. It's been a month since I set you on this task. Oh, You've yeah. been wandering Probably around, you got no over. drill bits to show for it? Listen, How man. are you going to inspire the confidence in the people of Sheffield? The previous mayors have apparently. failed, but these ones... We've only just taken office, but we are already on the case, and we are committed to delivering for the everyday mushroom on the street. How did hey. you even get in here? Did you get past my bee? Oh, that was your we bee. We just came through the portal. We talked to a bee on the way. We Good rode, the, we we rode the ultra tram here. You've been on the ultra tram? That thing's the deadliest thing I've ever seen. Yeah. All right. yeah. You have my confidence. In fact, I'm going to do more than have confidence in you. I'm going to hand you guys a map. Yeah. This is where our intelligence says pieces of drill are most likely to be found. You can't get them here, you can't get them anywhere else. Hmm. The Crucible, hmm. the Ski Village, the Industrial District, the Town Hall. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Where might we go first on our quest? There's one place on this map. Can we get to Sheffield's Smart Map? I don't think we've been there before. <laughs> Unfortunately, that is merely a description of the map. Ah. Again, not not the navigating capacity of a uh, Apache leader of the 1800s. I think uh, fortune leads us to the ski village. Ah. We're going with the captain, folks. Yeah, fortune favor. Yeah. We're going to the first thing that comes to mind. Ski village. Let's see what the what the real folk have done to it. All right. Well, the well, first I'll place where we're later. going. First place we're going is bed. Oh, get a light go. out. Best oi, of luck. Oi. Oi, oi. Good night, night everyone. Oi, oi. Good night. Oi, oi. Good night. Oi, oi. Oi, oi. Ski village. Ooh. You arrive at the ski village. Oh. In front of you, you witness the giant ski village Sheffield gate with its magnificent symbols of skiers and snowboarders and Mm -hmm. something in the bottom left. You also witness, is that some sort of scrap in the bottom Ah. right? Ah. You hear a strange figure scuttling round that stinks of peas. I'm not strange. (laughs) (laughs) Hello. Hello. That's not your scrap metal, is it? No, it's outside the gates. If it's inside the gates, I'd have cleaned it up by now Ah. as the dutiful groundskeeper of this flammable ski village. Flammable, you say? Hmm. 
But not I mean, currently on fire. Which no, is, no, no, no. Just because it's flammable doesn't mean it's always on fire. It should go in. <laughs> Thank you. We are... This... I mean, my personal goal is this season, if we can keep everyone with tracksuits from trying to slide down the ski slope, 50% ignition. Uh, I reckon that's the goal for this season. Oh, yeah. Oh, you didn't happen to see any uh, spare drill bits, or have you already cleaned those away? No, um, not really. Not really anything to do with me. Uh, I'm just going to sp- try and clean this off. Uh, no, that's D10 won't do that. It's a surface cleaner for um, mainly used for fruit preparation areas. Uh, uh, it's not. It's not going to clean it off. What do you think? Um, sort of thing. Tasty. What do you think uh, would get uh, this off here? Juvenile delinquent elbow grease. A used <laughs> child slave is that keyword? I thought I don't know. I mean, same initial, you, uh, but I was going to say community service. I feel like we should back away from the whole child slavery angle. Yeah, that's that's it's not a good angle. I don't think. Um, what about? <laughs> <laughs> your, your approval is skyrocketing for being anti-child slavery. Literally every mayor, they might not have said it, but every previous mayor too has been pro-child slavery. I'm not, so I'm not, we're not afraid to say it. That's that's what makes I mean, us different. It's good. It's good. Because, mm-hmm. well, I mean, my experience with the previous mayors is they never said, they never said they weren't. You know what I mean? So you assume, you know, most people are pro. So. Complicit. Hmm. Um, have you have you tried uh, mushy peas on that? On what? On oh, the, on the uh, surface of cleaning up. No, that would be yeah. stupid. That'd be a waste of mushy peas. I think honestly, it, it, it if I think that. mushy peas might actually be less effective than D10. Hmm. But I suppose right, you I'm on the inside. Tried. I've I haven't tried, but I have cleaned up a lot of mushy peas in the past. Hmm. What about a wire brush made of steel? Mm, I think that might abrade the paint, though. What I'm looking for is a ke- sort of a, ke- I think, a chemical solution that would remove the outer layer of paint without touching the under. Because I haven't, I don't want to repaint all of this. These have an intense pea flavour, by the way. Yeah. <laughs> right. So. Okay. Right. Well, we'll see if we I'm can sorry, find some. Do chemicals. you want? Well, um, I've actually got to get on. All right. <laughs> because um, Ultra Tram actually, they say it's better, but it actually they stop it working at about 10. It goes fast, but they, they take it offline earlier. Where do, what do you want to do with this? Uh, well, we'll figure it out. Uh, let's take that scrap metal and uh, see if we find some chemicals somewhere. Yeah, sure, sure thing. Um, do you want me to pop that in your pocket? Oh, yes, please, pal. Oh, if you, if you wouldn't mind, yeah. People are yeah, no. so helpful. There you go. Pop that in one of your three pockets. Thank All right, you, I'm going to... Um, unless there's anything else I can help you with, I'm going to hop on... If, um, if if we do encounter anything that that might help with your uh, your cleaning problem here, we'll let you know. Mm. Um, do you, you, do you want to hear my joke oh. about it? Oh, go on. Oh. Go on. Say, oh. I say, you, you might need to have D11 on that. <laughs> Did you like that? Oh, I think that's a good one. Yeah. Stream, element, stream elements is very happy. This that is not actually the criteria for victory. That's simply a, a gauge. Of your, <laughs> it's just a, it's just a gauge, isn't it? It's just a gauge. Um, victory would actually require saving the mushrooms, which we are nowhere near doing. Um, <laughs> Ski uh, slope or lodge or leave the ski area. These are okay. your three options. So, if we take this scrap metal to back to the portal, does that actually get saved for the next run? Not taking it to the portal. What do you think it would do at the portal? Uh, it would be there so that other mayors might trip over it along the way. Uh, let's, could... let's take it with us and see if we find any uses for it. 
Oh. Let's uh, let's let's go and investigate the lodge. Ah. What, what what do you mean by other mares, Geronimo? Surely this is now one mare forever, right? I mean, we're sky high in the ratings. That's is... right. I can't see how a mare could drop from ten points ahead. Mm. I don't see how that could happen. <laughs> every every other mare is pro child slavery, and we're just against it. And... That's right, mare. Yeah, we can't let. And you're creator of the Ultra Tram. Mm. Come on. <laughs> okay. Let's go to the lodge, see what trouble we can cause there. Oh. Let's do it. Okay. Oh, trouble. Um, right. We may have been seen next to this inferno. Oh, um, uh, I can't see any paparazzi. There seems to be something on the other side of the inferno. What does that look like to you guys? Uh, I don't know, but it sounds that a, dangerous. Is that a litter picker? Oh, in a ski village. Uh... Ah, it's a ski pole. It's with the, 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 the thing, and mm. Mm. I think uh, I think we need to move away from this fire. Good idea, Captain. Let's get out of here. We're not going to find any water around here, that's for sure. Do you want to check out the ski slope, or do you want to jet? Let's let's try the ski Ooh. slope. Hi, stream element. Hello. Hey. You were a short time in there, weren't you? Ooh, we're yeah, just uh, we're just on a little uh, on a wonder. You couldn't. Uh, you've not got a spare P wave there, have you? I've um. Oh, loads. Do you, want a, do you want a couple of P waves? If if that's all right, thank you. Yeah, no problem. Uh, pop them in your pocket. Yeah, that'd be great. Thank you. I'll put them in a different pocket to the scrap metal. Yeah, it's just yeah, unhygienic, that's... isn't it? Absolutely. Just yeah. pop. No problem, mate. Oh, let me rotate them a bit. Yeah. There you go. Perfect. Let's, um, anyway, shall we go and go and have a look at the, uh, the ski slope? Let's check it out. Me? Oh, yeah, there might be oh no, you. There. Okay, yeah, sorry. sorry. <laughs> yeah. I'll go on with I'm my job. Stream elements. <laughs> You're welcome to come Absolutely. with if you like. Absolutely. No, I don't want to. <laughs> stream <laughs> element, have you, have you got any more jokes about D10? <laughs> I've got one, but it's a bit too strong. You know, I have to keep it in the D12 bottle. Oh yeah. <laughs> let's let's get to the ski slope, please. You. <laughs> Okie dokie, ski slopey. Wow. wow. You see a primitive cardboard shack with the word rice on it. A tree. A huge mushroom that seems to have grown out on the ground in the ski slope. I wonder if that could indicate anything. Um, can you smell? I can actually smell rice. Can you smell that? I think, yeah, I'm getting that. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are urban exploring, are you? Uh, yeah. We got some urban explorers here. Oh, yes. Then you'll know all about me, won't you? They call me the Rice Man. Ah. <laughs> Reputation you always look. Why wouldn't it? Why wouldn't it? I'm almost never seen, and yet everyone seems to know who I am. Mm. Probably because I make the best, best bit of rice this side of uh, Better Hall. Ah, uh, yeah. So, so you haven't seen any people in tracksuits going around. It's not safe here. Too, fric too, much fric here. too much friction. Not allowed. This place has been burnt normal. down. A lot of people saying they saw the mayor next to a burning lodge, so that's... Um, he's, he's saying that. Maybe it could have been a mayor. Just people saying it. Yeah. I've seen it on um, Bebo. Oh. I, think this, I think this guy might be people. I'm people, baby. I'm Iceman. <laughs> My word carries a lot of weight, but I can make I can make a deal with you. I'm listening. If that janitor yeah. comes around looking for me, say I'm in there. Say I'm in that box that says rice. That's where you look for rice man, isn't it? In a rice box. And not only one I not tell people about the lodge, I'll give you a choice of two rices. One, I can give you some cool original. Or if you want to be walking on a wild side, I've also got some special Tony <laughs> Benz ready basmati <laughs> rice. If you want to be in the instant, maybe you've had a hard day clocking off, pushing cogs around. That's my offer. Hogs around you. I'm say. not hurting anyone. I'm not hurting anyone. I'm just urban exploring. This guy it's says not, he's not hurting anyone a lot. 
<laughs> I'm not hurt. I must be not hurting anyone. Yeah, scones. Was was sorry? Did you see a a, a mayor by a fire? No, no. Oh my god! I am run. I'm absolutely run ragged today. Mayor by a fire. That rice guy's back. Oh, is he? Oh my god! If if you if you see. If you see a guy walking around here trying to give out rice, will you give me a shout? Hmm. Rice, you say? <laughs> like that? Rice. If, yeah. If like, we see like that. The rice that's on that box. But how you spell it, right? Uh, that that box does say rice. rice. Yeah, that that would box. seem to be a good a good place to look for any kind of rice man. Yeah. You want to? You think he's in there? What well, says rice on it? Yeah. Right. I. I mean. I. I. I wouldn't. I. I. I didn't say that. I think it's in there. But it. It Let would be. A, it would be a place to look. It's a clue. Must Let be me. Dumb Let me get this. Let. Let's. Let's rip it off. I'm gonna kick this guy's head in. Right. I think this person's from real. I think they're from real. I got baboon tracky bottoms on. I've had enough today. Ooh. I've had enough. Right. Oh let's get this off. Oh my god. Oh my god, it's Lomadillo again. Oh my god. Why did she make you do that? That's disgusting. Oh my god. No. Oh, no. What do you want to do, Mayor? No. Mayor? What, what do you want to do? Uh, hold it back, hold it back. Hold the armadillo back. <laughs> Fend armadillo off with cardboard. <laughs> you guys did the Lord's work today. You did some good stuff. Iceman, make some promise. Iceman's going to keep that promise. Would you like... <laughs> would, you like some... <laughs> would you like some cool vanilla? Or hey, maybe you've had a hard day and you want some Tony Ben's ready rice. It's got to be Tony Ben. Yeah, Tony Ben's for the gears. Yeah. Bring on the bed. I'll pop that in one of your pockets. Let me look Thanks. in one of these pockets. Wow. Oh, it's full, full of metal. Full pockets and near empty popularity rating. <laughs> the voters are fickle. That's just my, like my life. Just like my life, eh? <laughs> Say goodbye to the rice man. Bye bye. Nice to meet you, the rice man. Farewell. Should we get out of here, man? Oh, yeah. Steel works. Steel works. Steel works. I've got a plan. I don't know so if might... this plan is going to work, but I think we've got two items that are relevant to the steel works. Okay, let's let's go to the industrial district. Click, 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 click. It's clicking. It's, I'm, I'm, I'm really trying. That is actually my hand. I'm really trying to smash it. The fast travels are kind of glitchy in Sheffield. It's just... Uh, it's still on a hard drive, so. Yellow car. And I sort of mustard one as well, but you don't say that, do you? No one says mustard car. Yeah, mustard's yeah. sort of a bit yellow in it, but not really. Which bit would we want to go to? Steelworks. 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 Yeah. Let's do it. Steelworks. We head to the steelworks with our three items in tow. Mm hmm. Do we have to have this permanent reminder of our terrible rating down? Yes. Down Unfortunately, yeah, because it's so low, it's just keeping you on edge in the UI. <laughs> it puts our critical. It's going dee -doo, dee -doo, dee -doo, constantly. <laughs> yeah, I can do that if you want. Uh... Beep, boop, beep, boop. <laughs> I'm not, not going to continue doing that. Okay, still don't say tin. We'll go and steel works. Mm -hmm. Josie's out. Josie Mayer's out. Must have said I'm still here. Hey, oh. Josie Mayer's back. Wow, it's a big blue Don't door that says it. danger, unsafe building. And there's knock, something scritting about in the... Can you see that peeping on the right? Hello. Warning. It's kind of Hello. warning there. Hello. 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 Talk to Hello. them. Hey, oh, pal. Hello. Who is it? Oh, it's the mayor. The mayor. Yeah, well, the current mayor. Stop saying current. Hey. <laughs> Forever mayor. Hello. Have Hello. you come to help my plight? Oh yes. 
just need to figure out what that is. So what's the problem? Oh, so what's the problem, pal? Um. Well, maybe I, I can't. I can't bring you in unless you've got some some scrap metal, so I can pretend that you're a you're a delivery person. Ah, well, that's convenient. We have some in our inventory. This pocket. We can. Um, we, it's what? We do sorry. Somewhere in there. I, I, I don't think we should just be giving it to. We bump into that. We'd like to to get to know you first. We don't I even think. know your name. No. What's what's your name? Lizzie, the elephant. Aww. I've worked here for probably two hundred years now, oh. without a single nice day. Nice to meet off. you, Lizzie. Wow. Would you like some scrap metal? Yes, and then I will explain my plight. Sounds like a plan. Thank you. Let me open the door. Come into my factory. Well, it's not mine. It's part of the problem. The elephant gently invites you into its factory. You see what looks like an extremely powerful snooker cue being forged of steel and some sort of entity slumbering in the background. Are you talking about me? No, no, you're in the foreground, Lizzie. You're not an oh, entity, you're an elephant no, wielding no, a wrench. I, no one told me about foreground and background. Just how to adjust the wrench. Ah. Uh, foreground and background. It's all, it's all staging. Uh, what's, what's that a smell? Hmm? What, what's that a smell? Oh, hello. <sighs> was that hello. A smell? <sighs> Let me just come over to you. <sighs> Oh, it's a rice cooker. Hello. Hello. I'm the rice cooker. Ah. Hello, the rice cooker. Are you any relation to the rice man? Or is that incidental? Yeah, we're brothers. Ah. We're brothers, but we've got a different... <laughs> <laughs> we've got a different father. Ah. Yeah, my father was a was a rice cooker. <laughs> <laughs> what? That's how it is, isn't it? Anyway, I can smell I can smell something absolutely delicious. Oh yes, what can you smell? Just kidding. Ah, it'd be the Tony Tony Ben's rice. The what? Oh, oh, no. 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 Yeah. Yeah. oh it's coming here. Oh, no. Tony Ben's rice. I ain't Tony Ben's rice. How could you do this to me? I know, Come I should have picked the first option. I should have picked the first option. You should have picked the first option. Oh, man. Mate. No, they heard about the lodge. You don't. The other leader would be 20 points ahead. <laughs> Two crimes. And now, yeah, I've got to take you back to the mayor's office and do what we do to every mayor that fa fails Sheffield. We got away with so much crime. Oh, did our rating just go up? No, that was, that was my arse. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Yeah, not gonna happen to me. I'm immortal. Aww. <laughs> <laughs> can I can I just have some pee ways before we before tell the, them, the okay, Josie, you can have tell a little them about the Yorkshire tea. The Yorkshire tea's not even from here. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> Kill them. <laughs> Wait, stop. What? <laughs> uh, I hid that from myself during prep because I didn't want to know. Uh, that's very good, Lloyd. Um, okay, the, this mayor has been lasered. We uh, the mayoral duties have been ended, and we're back. If I could just be transferred to my desk, please. Transferring now. Three, two, one. Get ready to hop. Now. Uh, uh, uh. Hi, 
folks. It's Escape the North. What an absolutely great game from that team. Hello, Jane Edwards, Mayor's assistant. Hello. Hello, Jack Evans, Mayor's assistant. That's such a gorgeous portrait behind you. Wow. What a handsome, absolutely not demonic or devil-like figure. I think it's very nice. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, I really like it as well. Do you want a uh, fellow mayor's assistant's uh, beverage? Oh, is that allowed? Oh, yeah. It's all on tap, oh free. Gosh. Oh, nice. There you go. I got this uh, fruit shoot, okay. so just smash that down. Should we just do the uh, mayor's assistant's administra administrative tasks? Um, go for it. I'm just going to smash it. So, uh, reception music uh, donated uh, five pounds for a fruit shoot. Purple one, please. Thank you. That's what we've got right there. Uh, disconnected Dan donated ten pounds for a framed picture of uh, this beautiful fellow here, Adam Lata, on the wall behind the mayor's assistance desk. Uh, Sarah K donated ten pounds. Please, can I add a golf umbrella with the Escape the North branding on it? Merch coming soon because um, oh. the weather's gone bad again. Uh, no office is complete without a branded umbrella in reception. Um, Maggie FBK tipped the huge £75 with simply the word GEF, G-E-F, full stop. Chat, if you can translate that, please do so. Um, hey, what, what, what have we got there? What's being brandished? It's GEF. It's GEF, and he absolutely stinks. Ah! He does smell. He Two does. and a half weeks from I'm now, out here. North I'm out here. Gaff gets deleted is... from your consciousness. I've opened the door over here. This should get the air going through. Gaff smells oh, okay. Yeah. Gaff smells. I might be no, off my smells, I... He smells. He smells. The, the pee's fresh at the moment. You're lucky. Listen, I've been smashing Hendos. Maybe if we give Gaff some a little drink of Hendos, might oh, yeah. might sort things out. Um, we got a flat Stanley. Uh, from donations suggested by Linderon, um, thank you very much, uh, for under the skirting board specifically. I believe that was where Sean was dwelling before. Um, so I think Flat Stanley, who is this character here, <laughs> am I? Am I right? <laughs> do, you wanna, do you like this? Do you like this fella, Jane? <laughs> yeah, he's, um, he's, he's very flat. Very flat. Very, if very flat. If you're not allowed to say that, um, but... <laughs> Just, and we don't mean physically, here. we mean, we Just mean... Excuse me, not under here, please. Yeah, it's, it's, already it's already occupied. It's we could put them on. in the skirting board of the... We could put them in the skirting board of the special room. Yeah, I love the special room. The skirting board in there. In don't the put them jellies. in with the jellyfish. Yeah, the jellies are there. contaminate the ocean Slamming with that lad. The jellies, hey, they'll, get, they'll have a nice time. They'll kill him, they'll sting shut him. The, shut the door on him. There we go, he's in with the jellies. Let's chuck him in. Um, drowned. They're Portuguese uh, lads of war. Just before I pop <laughs> out back into the um, lobby, uh, I was going to say, I <laughs> got confused, right? I so thought... You, a, a mayor has been accidentally rejected, is what we're saying here, Pete. What? Is that, is that what you're saying, been thrown back into the lobby? Oh, no, 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 no. I, well, no, you've really raised the stakes now. Oh, oh I just got okay. confused between... Flat Eric and Flat Stanley. <laughs> All right, mm. The stakes don't get much lower than that. <laughs> no. Yeah. They're, below, no they're actually noticed. below the stakes now. They're whatever's below stakes. Ham. Um, which is also very flat. Um, Red Kyote tipped five pounds. Thank you very much. Stegligs donated ten pounds, requesting a no snooker hooligans sign. Blam. Um, they've got to be stopped. They're absolute. Look at that one. That look at that. that. Is Just absolutely ruffian. reprehensible. For He's ruffian. ripped. Yeah, they're absolutely jacked. Um, looks like they've been to Geronimo's in real ill too many times, if you ask me. Um, <laughs> and uh, sometimes without even paying. Um, and uh, yeah, so thank you very much, uh, Stegliggs, for that sign so we can get those hooligans reined in. Um, Disconnected Dan donates five pounds for a brass plaque stating that the reduction in approval rating for delay cutting off the Sheffield River ribbon was grossly unfair. Um, Drama. 
Listen, the AI in this game is actually very, very powerful, and we're not actually always in control of it. We just go along with it. We kind of fear it. Um, but, you know, if it's written, and also if things are written on a brass plaque, they kind of become true, you know. I actually get my ethics from brass plaques. So, you know, got a lot of opinions about World War One and uh, beloved uncles who've got benches dedicated to them. Uh... Greavesy91, the 91st Greavesy, donated £10. Can I add a weekly planner to help the mayor spread out their ribbon cutting ceremonies? Listen, we got Google Calendar. I communicate with platinum bathrooms. I don't like to be mocked. I'm actually a very successful mayor's assistant. Only all of our mayors have been guillotined. Except that one laser in. Um, so you actually, you know, yeah, put it up, you know. You, you want it up? I'm not, I'm going to ignore it, but I, we, we can put it I'll up. I'll put it near your desk so that... Yeah, well, I'll put I it can ignore it near me. You can ignore it, but it'll be facing away from you, but near you, yeah. Uh, Cat Boxman, thanks for the resub. Anon, um, the Hacker Collective, has donated £10 to brighten up the office with some mall paper. Brackets... <laughs> Which I knew exactly what that would mean, but they have helpfully put repeat pattern wallpaper of Sean Molly's face, um, as crafted uh, by artist Sam O'Leary. There, actually, in that specific one. Um, check out Sam's uh, work; it's very good. He recently made a music Big video time. for some cool bands. It's cool. Um, uh, can we have a cultural sensitivity training poster up in the office, please? Yes. Um, there's some issues going on um, with the previous mayor with sensitivities to uh, Native American culture, uh, which we kind of maybe let slide there. Um, Maggie FBK gifted five tier one subs. Wow. So thank you, Twin A. Thank you, Maggie FBK. Josie Russell donated five pounds, a dedication to Merle. I've not made this yet. Has only just come in? <laughs> As I only, oh no, I was just, uh, I was just reading. I was off roading. We can make it all exist soon, though, Josie Russell. Don't you worry. Um, what does so a dedication look like? Isn't it a dedication? Listen, like... Sean, you're on that task. <laughs> I, it can be whatever. <laughs> it, will, it will yes and it, whatever you do. Uh, Jane Edwards, what did you think of the strategy we saw in the last playthrough? Absolutely, the best mayor we've ever had. Straight up. It was a shame to see all three of them really die. Such Um, a shame. There was some pro game in there, wasn't there? What was your highlight? Really, really good. Highlight has to be ribbon cutting. Has to be ribbon cutting. That's just a classic mayoral thing. You get that down and everyone pretty much trusts you. You know what I mean? So... The only thing that can boost a mayor more than that is probably Sean Bean scenes, but... Sean Bean scenes. If I saw a mayor... Talking to Sean Bean, I'd be like, it, I'd, better than, I mean, Burnham can't even do that. I'd be All like, right. wow, He's that is a cool, cool, cool mayor. If he actually, he signed and deletes it, but actually Burnham every week tweets at Sean Bean and Sean Bean just blanks him. Yes. Uh, I, I screenshot it, deletes it very quickly, but I've actually got them all screenshotted. Whereas I know a mayor, oh, your skin's so nice. I know, I'm, I'm, I'm wicked. I'm like that thing that everyone likes, wicked. Um, I'm such a big fan. <laughs> <laughs> it's can... because I'm very, you know, I'm very red. So mm-hmm. some, I, I don't like to be super red. So it's better just to be blue, just to be bright blue. Yeah. It just looks um, better. It's definitely an upgrade, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, Window Lloyd, is there anyone popping up the stairs? Any mayoral candidates? I, could, I think we've got a whole team coming up the stairs. They're walking up the stairs, but they're having to listen to Pete's stories first. And if you we go got to a, the queue, we've got you a could be hearing these. Pete's Tales, one to one. Yes. Got that Merle dedication. That's beautiful, I think. That's the thing. That's um, the thing. But we do have a full team ready. Fantastic. Fantastic. How are you, chat? How's things? Any chat got any questions? We'll answer them as best as a mayor assistant can. Andy Burnham, reply guy. It's not even a reply. He doesn't even reply. He directly ats him at nothing. He just yeah. ats him at the start of it. You know, you know the classic vintage Twitter, full stop, at Sean Bean. <laughs> that's, what that, that's what he does. Now and again, he goes, fancy a kick about, mate. 
Yeah. And then just nothing. Fancy a about nothing. fancy starting the mass privatization of the NHS, even though I'm seeing his left wing now. And then Sean B just blanks him. Fancy doing a photo shoot in a in a taxi with the sun on it. That's They're walking up the stairs now. They're walking up. They're walking up. They're walking up. Pete's finished the story and he's just pushing them up the stairs. Nice. You just know that story. I love it when Pete does that. We should do a separate Twitch stream of Pete, Pete just in the lobby. He's pushing them by the calves because obviously wow. they're up a step and he's pushing them. <laughs> wow. Calves. Like, like that? One by yeah, one? Yeah, yeah. Just like, it's real support, like really high boots. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's yeah. where you want the support. Yeah, yeah. Pete's hands on your calves or a saddle on a mushroom? Which right. is better, chap? Um, they're in. They're ready. Fantastic. Let's get Mayor in. Let's see if they can keep up with the last team. Let's go! Oh, sorry, Jane. I, I, do you want to hop? Do you want to hop in down there again, Jack? Yeah, yeah. Let's go. Ready? Huh. Jump. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh, anyway, so I'll nice. I'll see if we've got any more openings to do, mm -hmm. and you you get hooked up with the new mayor. Will do, will do. All right, see you later. Thank you. Love Pete, absolute legend. Um, so, let's go. Let's get Mayor in. Mayor One, come on down. Mayor One, inbound. Come on. Hello, friend. I can't hear Jack. You can't, can't hear, hear me. Oh, no. I could can just be doing mouth moves. I can hear, can you hear me. Strange stream. Yes. Can you okay. hear Jane? I'm talking. Hi. No. No. Oh, what about no. me? No, it was uh, just everyone who was in the lobby. Everyone in the lobby. Hit, hit refresh. Okay. F5. You want to meet man number two? F5. Sign language should be taught in all primary schools. Hot take. Oh, I think you can hear that. Hello, test. Hello, test. No. Yes! Yeah, scrap the sign language idea then. Mayor one. Um, <laughs> you feeling good? You feeling maily? I'm feeling very, very good. I'm um, <laughs> loaded with jet lag and it's got me yeah. wide, wide awake. Yeah, get lagged. Are it's you in a hotel? I am. I'm in a hotel. I knew you Tokyo. weren't. I knew you weren't at home. Sorry, carry on. <laughs> in Tokyo. In Tokyo. What? I know. Proper, Are you just proper casually in Japan? <laughs> yeah. I've never seen anyone so casually in Japan apart from actual <laughs> Japanese people. And I've not even seen that. I've been here a whopping 20 hours. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to the Tokimaki Memorial Edition of uh, Need some proof. Let's go to the North. Japanese snacks. What you got? What you got? Hold it up. Hold it up. Pocky. Po Pocky. What is what flavor? What flavor is that? What flavor is It's matcha flavor. Mm, it's very nice. Nice. <laughs> Can you do an yeah, ASMR yeah. eating of one of them, please? <laughs> yeah, get right into the mic. Yes. Oh my god. Okay. Crunch. Crunch time. <laughs> <laughs> Mm. Oh, I, feel nice. like I feel like I'm eating it. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Welcome, Japan Mayor. Um, I won't ask what you're doing in Tokyo. I don't want to know. I just I assume it's cybercrime. I assume it's cybercrime, and I don't want yeah, any more not? details. Okay, you. I hope you're successful. Um, it's fine. Guess, I'm in quarantine, so we're all good. <laughs> are you? <laughs> oh, I'm so. That is. Oh, I wish I was quarantining in Tokyo. That's so much. <laughs> it's exact same thing. Am I am I being back channeled with some information here? Um, okay. Um, sorry, there was a technical hitch which has been solved. Uh, Mayor two, please enter the game. Mayor two inbound. Hello, Mayor Hello. two. What is your location? Um, definitely not Japan. I'm in England. Boo. <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, but there's some, there's either leaves or fireworks happening behind you live right now. So you need to, you need to be safe. Beautiful. 
beautiful. Um, which you, you've been labelled England mayor, but you can have an alternate alternate name. <laughs> as can you, Japan mayor. I think. Should Japan we go back with the original? Does. Okay, I will be Mayor Pat, please. Mayor Pat. Mm-hmm. Okay, I'm just going to edit that post. in now. Same same character as Postman. Yeah, why not? Yeah, yeah. He's a good character. Yeah. He's a friend. He's got all the qualities that a mayor should have. Got a suspicion Sean Morley's in the uh, control of the text there. Uh, showing off. Um, England mayor, how, how would you like to be known? Um, I'd like to be known as Mayor Earn, please. <gasps> mayor Earn. E W N. E W N E R N. I can't spell. <laughs> Well, none, of spell, none of us need to spell. None of us need to spell. Mayor three, please enter the uh, the squad. We're squadding up. <laughs> Mayor three inbound. That's what the teens say when they're on the calls of duty. Hello, Mayor three. Hi. Are you in Tokyo? No, no, I'm not. Um, yeah. How are you feeling about that? Um, I mean, a bit gutted to be honest. Yeah, but uh, it's fine. It's chill. <laughs> Love and life. <laughs> <laughs> Gutted Mayor. Gutted Mayor, would you like an alter- alternate name? Yes, please. Can I be Mayor Oscar, please? Mayor Oscar. Incredible. Um, it's the, the, uh, I don't know if that's kanji, the, the Japanese font, which has been deployed by Sean Morley, has ruined <laughs> the Pattern Oster joke. That <laughs> um, but let me just say, I recognise it. I appreciate it. The chat will be buzzing for it. Um, <laughs> fantastic. fantastic. They haven't mentioned it. Exquisite. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, oh, I, I don't know failed. if that. Was, I don't know if that was Pete on Bat Channel, or Pete actually, but I assume you were patternostering constantly in the lobby there about about this plan. <laughs> um, so, um, dare we go onward and find out what your attributes are, Mayor? Let's. Yep. Let's find out what your attributes are. So let's give the category one. Let's get it up. Category one loading. Choose your flagship policy. It's the front ship of your uh, navy, the Vanguard. Fly tipping crackdown. Upright flies. <laughs> like this. The choices have been messed with, and I like it. Tram Ultra. <laughs> Tram Ultra, not Tram Few, Tram Ultra. Legalize petty criminals. <laughs> they, they, not crime, criminals. Criminals, yeah. Fourth option is childhood Tamagotchi daycare. They make sure they're okay. <laughs> they, sometimes they breed them. Um, you can breed Tamagotchis just like you can breed with a rice cooker. You just, you just do it. Uh, <laughs> what, I think what? I think we've got to go childhood Tamagotchi daycare because I mean on my route from the airport to the hotel I passed at least four of them. Oh my god! Yes, yes. They <laughs> guys, like pretty <laughs> criminals, pretty criminals. That's nice. That's nice. I think I just I I thought you'd only changed criminals and I blanked the. There's a study in that, isn't there, where you blank the middle of a yeah, a word. I think it already said pretty, and I didn't read the pretty, so someone's changed it to be all caps. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, well, I'll give you that choice authentically in case you want it. Legalize pretty criminals. I think very attractive people are more likely to get away with crimes anyway. I think that's already the case, but. Yeah, I'd, go, I'd agree with that. Yeah. So what are we, what we, we don't picking? don't want to promote that. Who's captain as well? We got any authority figure here? Just silence. <laughs> <laughs> Josie no, previously no just jumped straight in. I asked, is there an authority figure here? All three of you go. <laughs> Tamagotchi it is. Yeah. Yeah. Oscar's, Do it. Oscar's taking charge. <laughs> Tamagotchi daycare. Choose cause of scars. And I'm now going to read these extremely carefully. <laughs> Where attention to detail is not a characteristic of my brain. <laughs> so let's go. Created public sector job for brother. <laughs> so 
actually quite funny. Bir Birmingham was actually, because um, obviously Birmingham was heavily deindustrialized. One of the things the Blair government did to make it look like there was economic growth was provide a lot of kind of public sector work and just using brands. Uh, broke, broke own regs to meet from. <laughs> <laughs> Third choice. Had affair with an anachronistic motor car. <laughs> <laughs> Could have been a poly thing. You don't know if it was, you know. Fourth option, please. Is coated in Teflon. <laughs> brackets. PTFE. Close brackets. What's your choice, Mayor? What do we think? Public sector job? Do we like the sound of that? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <Probably>. Yeah. <laughs> it's a good it's one. got to be the public sector, hasn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Locked in. We can't privatise Brum. No. Yeah. No. <laughs> Brum's a national treasure. Um, so, um, little little question for Mayor Pat. What time is it in Japan? Chat wants to know. Oh uh, it's 5.40am. <laughs> <laughs> yes! This is why, like, this week's perfect because the jet lag means I'm awake perfectly. Next week, I'll probably be Glonko, but... Uh... You'll be fully Glonked, and, and yeah. but you'll hopefully still be playing, because, listen, you're not really gaming until you're playing a game at 5 a.m. <laughs> I've been up since the previous... That's gaming, okay? So, actually, you're, you're, a, tr you're a true gaming here, Pat. Um, okay, let's see what the next category is. It's your talent. What's your talent? knows why <laughs> a question that has plagued mankind humankind for decades can eat and digest rocket launcher <laughs> large burger in satchel <laughs> Primo just still says Primo Bundas, right? Or has the capitalization changed? No, I thought it'd be funny if the very last one remained the same. Oh. But but you're but you're you're looking too closely now. You think something has changed, but no, that is the same. It's you, yeah, you gave me the you gave me the fear. Primo I said, Bundas. I thought you said it was Spanish because I was trying to make it say it's the opposite Spanish. of Primo. It's just youth slang. Youth slang. Because if you type it in to put it into Google Translate, it thinks oh, it's Portuguese of cousin butts. It's two two separate things. Of uh, primo as prime as good, bundas I means but buttocks. My uh, I I I teach as a day job, and my students always ask if historic. They raise their hands if they're going to ask a serious question, and then ask me if a historical figure X, for example, they'll say something like, "Did Francis Bacon have hench bundas?" Um, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know how to stop it, and it's very hard to pretend it isn't funny. Um, so, would you like to know why Binde? And if you choose that, I'm going to ask you why, because I want to know why. Um, would you like the ability to eat and digest rocket launcher? Would you like a large burger in your satchel, or would you like Primo Bundas? Pre primo bumdas, which just gets your ass as white and white. <laughs> as much as the bumdas sounds good, I think we've got uh, past history with burgers, so it's got to be the burger. <laughs> oh, Large yeah. burger in satchel. Yeah. Lock it in. Uh, everyone in chat saying HB for hench bundas, which is actually what the HB on the pencils stands for. Right. <laughs> Not a lot of people know that. <laughs> um let's uh let's go to your office mayor and see what's who's petitioning or are we totally skipping that just to clarify and going straight to the uh the outside straight outside mayor let's go Ooh. who needs to talk to the people oh. whoa oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> the previous mayor's tram is there, oh and it's equipped God. with a rocket launcher, the Ultra oh Tram. Of course. Um, <laughs> what's the plan here, Mayor? How, how do you talk down a tram? <laughs> <laughs> try to initiate uh, this. Try to initiate conversation with it. Excuse me. <laughs> Kind of in a way. 
Okay, yeah. it seems to actually be... Hold back, mate. A fight seems to be breaking out between a B and the Ultra oh. Tram. Let's just back off. Oh <laughs> Come on, B. Wow. Redeem yourself. Come on, B. You got this. Think about the bins in that tram. This is an intense battle. Wow. Should we try to sneak past and go into the mushroom? That's bad. I think sneaking yeah, is a good idea. Do, yeah. do you see the mayor just let a tram kill a bee? <laughs> do you see the mayor just did nothing while a tram that's just killed a bee? Disgusting. That's 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 sick. Who does that? Yes. Why is there a rocket launcher on the yes. new tram? This is... That's high money, that is, that's gone on to that yeah. rocket from, launcher. Get away from these cities. To the mushrooms, please, quick. I'm on 90% tax band and you're spending it on books. Oh, wow, the bee took them both out. <laughs> Their ratings won't matter now. Quick, quick, get on the tram, get on the tram. Let's get on the tram. Let's go. Oh, God. <laughs> that tram. Wow, the previous mayor's tram really, really sucked. Let's get in that mushroom. Oh. Don't worry about that rating. That'll go right up. I mean, the previous mayor's had great rating, and look what that did for him. Should, mm. should, yeah, should, should we just sort out this B? You know, like... Sh should we? <laughs> I, feel, I feel like it's not... doesn't really do anything good, does it? That B is arcade. You've this made me so happy, allowing one. me to attack the Ultra Tram, for it ran <laughs> over many of my hives. I will vote for you next time. Hey. Now, may I stab one of you? <laughs> <laughs> let's get out of it. Let's just uh, run away. I mean, if, if it makes him happier. It, yes, it, it would. It would. Go <laughs> <laughs> on, Oscar. You can take one for the team. I'll take it. Okay. <laughs> okay. Fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be on my way now. <laughs> <laughs> wow. How many times like can bees do, sting man? without dying? It's a special bee. It's a different bee. <laughs> it's like a. It's an. It's an ultra bee. I was going to say, is it too late to mention that I am allergic? Anyway, let's go to the mushroom. <laughs> <laughs> it's not a normal bee. Ooh. bee. Ooh. Ooh. Should we, uh, wake up? Ooh. Yeah. Buck, buck, buckaroo for a buckaroo in good time. Ooh. Don't have a buckaroo, but excuse me. Uh, uh, no. Uh, uh, <laughs> what? Uh, Oh my god! <laughs> what the heck do you. Where's the old man? Long story. I'm dead. Yeah, that's dead! Was... <laughs> cool! Where are my drill bits? I'm broken on it. Where's my fuel? And what coming... exactly are you doing to work on it? Tell me exactly, step by step, what your plan is. Yeah, mate, what's the well, point? We, we don't know that unless you see the map. I so gave a map to going. your assistant of the previous mayor. Did yeah, you I can get the map me out. Up? I took it off the corpse. Come on, let's uh. just... Yeah. No, get that out of my face. I'm not done talking <laughs> here. Oh. <laughs> have you been watching what the previous mayors have been doing? Yeah, it was pretty yeah, cool yeah. thought, wasn't it? Yeah then you should be fully equipped to make some kind of progress or advancement towards the collection of the drill bits to create a new fissure in the earth so me and the mushroom people can play buckaroo in peace. But, but, buckaroo in good time. Buckaroo in good time. You've said it, buddy. <laughs> 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 yeah, I think yeah. we best get looking then. Pronto. Absolutely! Now get out of here and let me rumple up back in my little cloth knapsack. Night night. Ooh. I'm gonna put the harness on his hindquarters. Don't buck it. Don't buck it off, please. Um, okay, man. 
That's uh, don't book. Oh my god, don't book. Let's have a look. Uh, we go? What's, what do we think needs to be done? What happened to the last mayor? Could have put a rope rope on around the what? leg. Don't book it off. They got the wrong kind of rice. So how do you think we could progress in the same way as them by obtaining the correct kind of rice? Maybe. Yeah. Yeah, why not? And where would we do that, folks? Ski village. Let's go. Flammable ski village. Please, little donkey, I don't mean you any harm. Can we pop to the mayor's office and grab the fire extinguisher to take with us? We're only going to need that if it's on if it's on fire. We can go back. What do you mean? If? Not that bit of the mayor's <laughs> office. Hey, listen. You know, I want to have faith. Okay. <laughs> the last mayor went near the inferno and immediately, you know, got seen and some bad stuff came out of it. So I'm. I don't yeah, know. but if if we're seen putting it out. Exactly. Smart. Very smart. Let's grab the extinguisher. Right, right. Are we sure? Just to clarify, we want to take the extinguisher out of the mayor's office. The right. base of the game, just just flag it. Well, we are the mayor, so cool. as long as we bring it back, it'll be second, fine. Second question: funding has been cut quite radically. Are we sure <laughs> the extinguisher is full? Ooh. Half full since last time. I, I think we can check this later. I don't know. I don't know if we, I, I don't mean, have the technical skill to check. So Pete did inhale quite a lot of it last time. Mm. Yeah, I don't know if we. There's only one way well, to We'll take it anyway, just don't Let's get to the ski village, yeah. Let's get to the ski village. We can but try. Hmm. Oh. oh. Hey. Hey. Can... Hello. <laughs> hey, will you... <laughs> Gavel. Yeah. Get... <laughs> get out, right. Okay, I'll keep gaveling. You run. Run to the ski village. I'll catch you up. You know, the sort of corporate elite think they can just bully us. It's just it's <laughs> disgusting. Just, oh, I'm the child of an industrialist. Get out. <laughs> I can smell I can smell peas, stream elements. That's stream me. Elements. <laughs> hey, <laughs> never did quite catch your name. The, the mayor? You're talking to the mayor or the mayor's assistant? No, mayor's assistant. I'm the mayor's assistant. Okay, great. Is that your official title? Yeah, mayor's assistant. <laughs> Shit name. <laughs> right. Hi, Stream Elements. Could you uh, tell us? Could you tell us if this fire extinguisher is full or not? You seem um, to have experience. <laughs> <laughs> what you think is the gun, Darren Brown? <laughs> Arbitrary sealed it, containers are full or not? Yuri Geller here. No, I can't. <laughs> you want something wiping down and then to a suitable degree to eat food off? I'm your man. <laughs> she managed, you have... um, I've actually just been notified by HR that my actual name on that I wrote on the documents is Mayor's Ass. Uh... <laughs> Was it one of those ones where they made you write individual characters and you got all the mm -hmm. way to the end? And it got to the end for optical character recognition. Very outdated technology. <laughs> mm. And I don't know if it means ass as in like that donkey type thing or ass as in like a bum, a, mm -hmm. a bun, hench bunders. <laughs> I'm the mayor's hench bunders. Ah, that clears that up then. That's actually my Welsh name. Ah. Uh. <laughs> this side of the border, mayor's assistant. Please continue. Sorry, what, sorry, what are we doing here, guys? <laughs> I'm just, I'm just busy. We're gonna grab, we're gonna yeah. grab the scrap metal just as a. Well, I was. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, I've polished it up for you. Oh, thanks. It does look shiny. No problem. Yeah. Thank you. And uh, do you have any of these uh, P waves going around spare? You could. A uh, couple of P waves. Uh, yeah, uh, lobby a P wave. Ready to catch it? Uh, oh. Well done. Wow. <laughs> Stream Elements' arm goes all the way to the other side of the fence. Yeah, wow. it does. It does. Well spotted. Um, I don't know what to say. I'm just a simple caretaker. And week on week on week, the mayor comes and I have nothing to give. I, I just, I want my ski village to not be on fire so that I can hmm. clean its various surfaces so that people can eat snacks after 
or before, but not during, skiing. Shall we um, head to the skates, like? Uh, lodge first. Do you fancy I go the lodge first? first? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, why not? See you guys. Thanks, Dreamer. See ya. See you guys. Right. <laughs> 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 My hair stinks. <laughs> It's all good, as expected. Um, yeah. Take charge of the situation and use the fire extinguisher on the fire. <laughs> and hope that it's still got some in it. And that it's the right type of fire extinguisher. <laughs> Should we try to use the... You take the fire extinguisher out of your inventory and use it on the fire. Is powder correct for this kind of fire? I can't remember. Oh, my no, I can't. training. It's extinguished, but the weight of the fire extinguisher has dropped the item that was behind the fire into a bottomless pit. That's right. Um, well. Ski slopes? Yeah. No. <laughs> Hopefully no one saw that as do that. Oh, well. You approach a little tiny cardboard shack with the word rice on it, an innocent-looking bush, and you hear someone rustling about. <laughs> I let you in, <laughs> right? Where's my assistant? Assistant caretaker. Sorry, I've trapped you again by being too large. Assistant caretaker. <laughs> Oh, sorry in. about that. Yeah. It's no problem. I let them in, right? Yeah. They threw a, a flipping fire extinguisher, that one that the mayor gave me about two weeks back. They just <laughs> threw it through the floor, through some of our good fires. Not our good fires. That's awful. I mean, you're keeping your good fires far too close to the ski slope. We were definitely doing you a favour, considering how many fires you have on the ski slope. Yeah, because we want, to see the good, we want yeah. people to see the good fires from the ski slope. It's part of the attraction. It's part of the it's... whole thing. Have you ever heard of the word beacon? <laughs> <laughs> oh, laugh, laugh it off. Laugh off the word beacon. I apologise. I, I thought I was trying to help. There is another fire behind. Yeah. Does we've restored the fire? Does that help? And now there's different, worse fires. Worse fires. It's who, not the who same fire. These fires? Who, who started that fire then? We're all here, so it's clearly not who, us. Who, We're all innocent. Who can know who started which fire when? Right? What are we? Matthew, Mark, Luke, John. John Fire. No, the Gospel lads. You know, because they were good at yeah. documenting things. It's it, it similarly it doesn't work. Fire. I'm under pressure. Well, we're not Billy Joel. Oh, well, that. Could, all right. Um, good. <laughs> he doesn't like the New Testament. Sorry. <laughs> Thanks for scaring those guys off for me. Hey, come closer. Come closer. Come closer. Do you want some rice? Yes, please. Yes, please. Yes, please. I've only got cool vanilla. Is that all right? I think that's yeah. nice, yeah. 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 Yeah, it's pretty good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, this stuff, um, I'm glad I'm out of the instant anyway. If you just get that, my brother get near instant. Well, don't need to bring up family. Yeah, I'll pass this <laughs> over. Stick it in your pocket. Right. I'm gonna go back Brilliant. exploring. Gonna head yeah. up the slope here. Wish me luck. Yeah. <laughs> Have fun. Yeah. Watch out ah! for that fire. Oh. I did warn him. There, there's quite a bad fire in the uh, in the background there. We should probably leave. Yeah, well, no, no. Yeah, yeah. That's just a good fire. That's a good fire. Oh, okay. Oh, that's all right then. Cool. We'll, we'll leave that uh, uh, fire. Hey, have you taken care of that? box recently did you look in there I have a, uh, caretaker two i've box. had a look what's in there um really rather not talk about it 
Well, you, I think you're gonna. Do you want to have a look? I'll, I'll have a look. Yeah. Um, I'd probably advise you don't. Idea. To be honest. Yeah. Look, this um, is this is. Are you a, are you a caretaker of a ski village? No, and we don't. That's exactly. Then, then please leave. Can we um? We've got. Can we leave before you lift this? Yeah. yeah. It's a bad oh, noise. Oh, this is. There. I think you're making a mistake. <laughs> oh. It's going to. <laughs> let's leave. Let's yeah. Let's, let's, let's go. Yeah, we should we, we should we should try to get away from here. This is this is this is getting this is going sour. <laughs> <laughs> Can you bring up? Oh, more that. Oh, that is ah. I did, why did I touch it? Why did I touch it? Um, Big brain moves. Okay. I feel like what's happened in that ski village is a ticking clock. As soon as the press get hold of that, we're in trouble. We need to get moving. Yeah. Let's get to the um, industrial district industrial then, district? I guess. Yeah. Industrial district, let's go. Would we want to go to the Mushy Pea Factory or the Steelworks? Uh, steelworks? steelworks yeah. Okay. Yes. Let's go. We're going to the Steelworks. It's going to happen. <laughs> Don't you worry. Whoa, look at the state of that elephant. Oh, I mean, careful what you say. I'm startled. Whoa, no. It was like, a, look at the state of that. You know, like... It's because I'm tired. I've been no, working it's not, for uh, it's not a 200 stem, years. <laughs> I, that's a long shift. Yeah, yeah. It's a, it's a, Do you? It's a rough shift. I, I will have to close the door unless you have anything to give me. Uh, oh, we've got some steel. Steel? Yes. If, no. you, if you pretend to be a steel delivery person, then maybe you can come in and discuss with my, my boss my plight. We're happy yeah, to do that. Right. That sounds like a deal, yeah. Guess how big this wrench is? Very. Like a metre? A metre? No. It says it, but it's pixelated. <laughs> no, it's not. No, oh, is it not? It's pixelated. Like... No, it's quite clear, actually. Oh, it's... oh. oh. oh it's 150 metres. Yeah, it's 150 metres. It's just when you're on the internet in Japan, everything it's very yeah. far away. Well, very far away. Long yeah. wire. <laughs> very long <laughs> wire. <laughs> Can I have your scrap metal, please? Here you go. Um. <laughs> Thank you. Do you think this elephant's to scale to that wrench? <laughs> <laughs> no, the no. Questions. I'm using my trunk to hold it very far away. <laughs> <laughs> Come inside. <sighs> Into the factory. Oh, there is a guy. real angry <laughs> rice cooker. They had such a bad time before that that rice cooker is angry and then it's become exhausted and gone to sleep. Sorry about that. <clears throat> yes, so, um, I've got an issue with my with my boss that maybe you could sort out? We hope to help, yes. 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 Oh. <sighs> Sorry about that. Before, I've had a little sleep now, so I feel a lot better. Good to hear it. I can smell some food absolutely delicious. Mm, got some What's your name, rice cooker? <laughs> my name? My name is Big Billy Rice. <laughs> lovely to meet you, Big Billy Rice. It's lovely to meet you as well. Here, here's a little song I wrote. I want to sing it note for note. Don't worry. Eat rice. <laughs> That's a beautiful song. Thank you, thank you very much. I can smell something extremely delicious in your pocket. 
that's a um, would that be the pea waves or would that be the vanilla rice the, the vanilla rice Can I have a, just a look at it? Yeah, definitely. Oh, 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 can, I, can I cook it? I'd be honoured if you did. Oh, oh, thank you very much. Oh, oh, put, put me in me. Oh, that's absolutely... Oh, oh that, that feels lovely. That feels absolutely delicious. I, I, I'm just going to... I don't want to watch this. What are we doing here, man? Oh, 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 that feels... That feels wonderful. Oh, um, what a you're, fantastic you're, you're, um, mayor. You're smashing it. You're absolutely nailing this. You're smashing it. Oh, and I just produced the most delicious curry. Oh, if excellent. Mm. Yes, please. There you go. Oh, oh do you know, it gets, it gets very boring round here. That's the most fun I've had for years. <laughs> oh, I'm so glad to help, Big Billy. Oh, you, you wouldn't mind if I come with you? Not at all. Guys Why not? Like an absolute laugh. More the merrier. <laughs> You acquire one sentient rice cooker. <laughs> what would you like to do now, Mayor? Um, that that thing that's been are those slaves? That that looks quite interesting, doesn't it? Yeah, it's the oh, isn't it the? Is it a snooker cue? That that that's the word. It is a snooker cue. Word. I wonder how we could obtain that. Yeah, how would we acquire such a snooker cue? Sure. Can we go speak to the boss, perhaps? Yeah. Well, um, I could sneak one of those one of those metal poles off the production line if you um sort me out just maybe one day off, just one. Who, who do we need to talk to to get you a day off? My line manager, the boss. <laughs> I just desperately, Boston. desperately want annual leave. <laughs> Fair enough. Oh, so you've had two hundred years without annual leave? Yeah, and I believe that they don't. It doesn't roll over. Let's go talk to the boss. Yeah, let's go talk to the boss. Make him roll it over. I love being a tree. I love being a boss. <laughs> Let Hold up! <laughs> oh, uh, thanks for coming in. Is it the mayor again? It is. Yes. yes. Nice to meet you. Again. Luckily, it's a different mayor. I didn't have such a good time with the last one. It didn't go. Uh, it didn't go particularly well. No, um, the last one was a shit. Just you know. The last. Just, let's not even that, go there. That's what I like. <clears throat> a mayor who tells it how it is and doesn't mind <laughs> using the S bomb. Vern, that's <laughs> nice. You and me. And I've got to say, I'm really embarrassed that you're here because my office is just dreadful. My office is looking like the pits. And I, there's no place for a mayor. Look, my leaves are falling off. I've got. I'm living in mulch and absorbing the moisture from the mulch of many fallacious books, like the one I've just added to the pile here. Is there anything you could do to help me clean it up? Do you know? Because. I've never come across dirt before. I used to live in a forest where all dirt was considered good, but now I live inside. I don't know of any cleaning products. Do you know of any? Ah, uh, I've heard of a mythical D10. Yeah, but it's... Have you got some D10 to give me? We don't have any right now, but I'm sure we could acquire some. Hmm. Yeah. So he gets me some D10. Well, um, if we can get you that, would you do us a favour in return? What do you want? Well, you've got um, a really lovely member of staff out there um, uh -huh. who hasn't had a day off in 200 years. You mean the years. rice cooker? I mean, the rice cooker is great, but also... Yeah, the rice cooker is great. Also, Liz Lizzie the Elephant. Oh, Lizzie the Elephant. Going on and on again. She's only had to work 200 years straight. And she still doesn't stop giving it. All this and all that. Oh, why have you made me hold them? 
150 meter long spanner constantly even though my work doesn't i'm mainly just working on the floor i don't actually screw anything in shut up that's what i say i'm a tree well, that's fair it's understandable but you know it is one of the mayor's new policies is you know anyone who achieves 200 years of constant work gets a, a celebratory day off mm. This is why I can't stand these left-wing mayors. You want it? You want it? All, you want to be in the papers? You want to be talking about you on Bebo saying this and that, this and clicking rebeeb? This is the real world. Nevertheless, well, we want to help everyone. Bring me we'll help you tidy you, up. You bring me D10. I'll give the elephant a day off. Capitch? Fair deal. Are you capitch okay. with what I'm saying? We I'm might have to hold off on the D10, Mayor, as we have been summoned to Sean Bean's mansion for Sean oh. Bean's scenes. This now could Sean be Bean's quite still alive. Tense. Unfortunately. <laughs> Stand by. Uncharacteristically. <laughs> Has there ever been a film where he hasn't died? Here we go to Sean Bean's scenes. Oh, okay. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Hello, Sean. <laughs> okay. Are we sure he's not dead? <laughs> <laughs> Hello! 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 It's me, Sean Bean. Welcome, How are you doing? Welcome to my Yorkshire abode. Do you like me films? I love your films. Um, yeah. Which is your favourite of me three films I've done? Free films. I've done Golden Eye, Lord of Ring, <laughs> and Spiky Chair. <laughs> I've also made the documentary Sharp, of which I've got a cardboard cutout. <laughs> Was that documentary about Pat Sharp? Don't you, don't you bring up Pat Sharp, my evil brother. <laughs> <laughs> now you join me for my challenge. I give the mayor on an annual basis called Storm Bean Scenes. If you're to be mayor of Sheffield, you must have knowledge of Sheffield's greatest actor's work. The truth of my great works. Me, Sean Bean. Always the hero, always successful. Always living to the end. <laughs> so, Mayor, let's have a look. What do you know about Sean Bean scene? So firstly, and be very careful, what is the story of my character Sean Bean, that's what they're called in the film as well. What does Sean Bean do in GoldenEye? You double O six, were you not? What? What? What are you saying? You played the double O six. What happened to it? Like. What happened to double O six, mate? You didn't die, you faked your own death. Let's go because on. Sean Bean would never die. Mm. Correct! You smashed it! <laughs> well done. Now my next film, my next film I did after, right after Golden Eye, for the back of that success I did. Lord of the Rings, where, as you can see, I was depicted as the main character on the poster. What happened to my character, Sean Bottomir? 
<laughs> you are in Lord of the Ring. You went on a great adventure uh, to to oh, find I... find the ring in the title of the movie because. Oh, I... Because, you know, that's what you do in the movie, and that's why it was titled that. Um, <laughs> that's what I do. Then what happened? And and you you didn't die. No, no, no. No, that's you, right, you, got, that's you right. got your ring, and you, you got back home nice and safe, and it was it was a great adventure um, of Rolling Hills and all that. It's, it's actually not really an action movie. It's more of a... Uh, it's more of a Sean Bean smashed it film in it yes on the travelogue exactly. yeah, yeah yes yes almost is. as good as the documentary sharp mm, okay now what happened in this film here this film was actually about 10 hours long what happened in that <laughs> clues in the image really yeah you got you got to sit on a big fancy tro throne throne <laughs> with your lovely yeah. swords um, and it's all in, all in black and white, uh, contrary to Lord of the Ring, um, there's, a, there's quite a lot of action in this one. You ended up being all heroic and not die at the end of it. Correct. <laughs> <laughs> You've actually smashed it. Now I hear there's someone after some D10. So you better go get it quick, sharp. Eh? <laughs> 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 Do you get it? <laughs> Do you like me, jerk? <laughs> get out of my mansion! <laughs> get out of my mansion now! Yep. We'll be off then. <laughs> oh, hello. Right. Where, where are we going to go now? Because if we go oh. back to the ski village, we not, might not be very welcome. Um, well, it's worth a try because I don't think we've seen D10 anywhere else. Okay. Yeah, I agree with that. So, uh, <coughs> it's worth a try, if not. Do we need to wait for the mayor's assistant, though? Can we whip yeah. back the gold oh, curtain? Or not. Or just delete him altogether. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. oh, that's right. Sometimes hey. I just have to go in my little bed. What happens is I get overwhelmed. I stare vacantly as if I'm waiting for something to happen. Uh, Do no. you feel rested forever? Ah, uh, yeah, I feel. Uh, so we're going to. Uh, we think in Ski Village. Ski get after yeah. the old D10. Yeah. Yeah. What's the plan when you get there? Um, we can oh. give him the curry. Oh. Yeah. We could give him the curry. Give him the curry. Give him the curry, yeah. yeah. We are off to the ski village. Let's get away from this dangerous <laughs> bin. Get away. Ow! Ah! Oh! Oh! Get, let's get out of here. Let's go to the ski village. Let's go. Ah! Oh. All right there. You arrive at the ski village to find it in a raging inferno. Stream elements awaits at the gates. Is it a good fire? I well, know it's going to take a lot of D10 to clean this up, lads. <laughs> well, as soon as you do have quite a large supply of D10, could we borrow some? Please. I mean, we could trade some. We know you like trading. Mm. Mm, do you want the D2 instead? <sighs> no, there's not, not enough D. Not enough D. No, no, you want the D10? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. D10, definitely. Take it from me. <laughs> I mean, we'd rather trade it in a polite way. Nah. Are, are you hungry? No. No. You want the D10? Take it. I'll tell you what. I'll give it to you. Thank you. If you can take it from this guy, though. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, oh, feed the curry to the armadillo. Yeah. Yeah, let me... that smell? 
You know what armadillos have? Leprosy. It's true! Armadillos do have leprosy! <laughs> Yay! Yay! Sean! Leprosy! Sean, guess what Jack yeah. just said? <laughs> I was under the wall! <laughs> what do you say? Ah, we've been haunted by the mayor! Oh, sorry! I totally <laughs> forgot to kill him! <laughs> <laughs> uh... <laughs> That's better. Cover up the ghosts. No, the, no one saw anything. Oh, wow. Look at the uh... <laughs> resting smug face. Uh, donated 20 pounds and says, Mayor Fetish Community says hi. <laughs> 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 uh, disconnected Dan. Donated five pounds for a panda bin for the office. Can we get that? Uh sorted i don't know if that, i don't know if that exists um robel robel sester robel kester uh, said a dog of your own choice please i believe we briefly saw that dog cover up a ghost mare momentarily um thank already you, coming in handy <laughs> thank you rosa dogs are very useful thank you rosanna 20736 for the uh five pound donation thank you maggie fbk for the 25 pound donation which probably unlocked um Sean Bead scenes. Uh, thank you. Thank you all. All players, all mayors. You are very well played today, I have to say. After a brief hiatus, we've come back and both teams uh, made absolutely astounding progression with uh, very, very good, well thought out gameplay. Um, and uh, thank you very much for chat and viewers who have been as amazing as always. Um, any comments from the rest of the maze assistant team, including there's a the window Lloyd has become gargantuan. But as is the dog, the dog is huge though as well. So yeah, yeah well, what are we to make of that? I I, I think I gotta get a bit bigger to be honest. I I cleaned up the inventory. I just threw that in the panda bin. <laughs> so I thought, yeah. Are we finishing it here? Is this where we're rounding up? Um, it feels like we could. It feels like we could finish it. Here. Could finish could it. Yeah, I think not? this. I think yeah. it's better to finish it here I than think the other place. I like is, this place. We got better. all our stuff here. We got we got the the snooker hooligan sign, the panda bin, yeah. the dog. We got all our gear. We got the door. There we flat go. Flat Eric in there. There we go. <laughs> Can we have that open a bit longer? I love that. I yeah, love please, jellies. Yeah, crack it open. Please. Should we all just chill out for the end of the... Yeah, it's so What's nice, that, that music. Mm. 10, or ten, 10 or 15 seconds to just relax, because it's 10 been or a 15 while. minutes. Yeah. Two minutes, two minutes. Dog's going to sleep. Escape the North chill stream. It's time to go to bed, everyone. It's time to have a nice, restful night's sleep where you think about an elephant that's 200 years old being exploited. Where you think about a rice cooker that's sentient. Where you think about a real big dog. What do you think about jellyfish? Good night, escape the northerners. It's time for Betty Bye Byes. Please check out the credits to find out all the other things we do. There's mandatory redistribution party podcast from Sean Molly and Jack Evans. Oh wow, sounds great. Everyone's doing live gigs again. We're all comedians. There's Landcraftshire. 
were Pete and myself, role players Fred Dipner and his assistant. There's Jane Edwards range of custom guns carved from bones. They're the best way to kill. They're the best way to live. There's Sean Morley's streams. Yeah, check me out. Twitch.tv slash Sean Morley every Wednesday and Saturday. This, is there anything else we can plug? We're in Leeds next week. We're in Leeds. Is that next? Is that next week? I, I feel like it might be. I think it might be next month. Oh. We're in Leeds, my, me, and, me, and, me and Jane are doing a gig. That guy's so flat, he's so flat and calm. We're in Leeds, doing uh, the Hyde Park Book Club, doing stand-up comedy real for real. I'm gonna go out this window. Yeah, you. See you later. Anyone I'll, coming out the window? Yeah, let's all go out the window. Oh. Good night, Jane, escape the Jane. North fans. Jane is going to be reviewing crisps in Jack Evans' car yeah. for an hour. Yes. Uh, well, actually, we're, we're going to film for an hour and then cut it into various TikToks. Make sure you're following Jane on TikTok. Follow me on TikTok, guys. See you later. See you later. Follow Jane Bye. on TikTok. Bye. We love you all. We love you.